Today I'm here in the coronavirus lockdown to do a quick talk about pedal board power supplies, specifically the Chox DC7. In my opinion, the Chox DC7 is one of the best power board pedal supplies that you can get. It allows you to power an enormous amount of pedals at the same time. It has a huge power output, so it can power modern pedals such as the Line 6 HX Stomp. The outputs, each one of them is isolated, so that reduces electrical noise and the sort of buzz that you'll get through your amp. And then also it's extendable, so you, you can plug extra ones in um, if your pedal board is to grow over time. When picking a power supply, it's important to think about the number of pedals that you want to power. I've seen some fantastic tiny pedal boards powered by small power supplies, far smaller than something like this. But if you have a decent amount of pedals or you plan to grow your pedal board then you need to look at a larger power supply. Um, there are some amazing sort of flagship power supplies from brands uh, like OneSpot, Voodoo Lab um, or even Strymon uh, and several of them are extendable as well. But my favourite is the Chox when I've looked at the spec and how it fits my pedals. The key things that I wanted were a large power output so that I can power my Line 6 HX Stomp, lots of outputs um, so that I can power all of my pedals and each one of these outputs is configurable between 9, 12, 15 and 18 volts. I want the ability to extend the power supply as my pedal board grows um, and each of the outputs I want to be isolated so you get less of that electrical buzz through your amp. And then finally, I wanted the out. I've got a number of pedals that are both 9 volts or 18 volts. For instance, the um, the MXR slash Wah is an 18 volt pedal, and so with this, I can power that no problem. There's quite a few other cool features of the Chox DC7. Um, it has flex leads so that you can. And make sure that you're connecting the right the pedals the right way and so you don't damage them. Um, it even has a USB charge point so you can charge your iPhone or your iPad whilst you're working with your pedal board. It has an indicator system that shows the amount of load that is going through the power supply at any one point so if you're getting close to the maximum you can think about that. And also it's super thin super thin so it can slot under a pedal board. I think it's a great piece of kit, it's uh, one of the more expensive ones on the market but to me it feels well worth the investment. Thanks very much.